Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Tom Heaney. The channel is Tom Heaney Adventure. Today I'm going to discuss uh, two lanterns, both from LED Lenser. This is the LED Lenser ML6 Warm Connect. It is the most recent edition of the ML6. And this here is the ML4. Um, what I will do is I will show you lots of footage of the lights actually working uh, at night, so we'll look at some of that later. Uh, I'll also discuss the features and benefits of, of both the lights. And then to conclude, I'll sort of um, discuss, you know, are, are these worth the money? Because I think in the real world, you know, we're always paying money for a certain product and we think, yeah, you know, is that worth the actual money? And lastly, I'll sort of talk about, you know, whether I would take these uh, in my backpack for overnight uh, wild camping trips. So first up really is the uh, ML4 Warm. Uh, this is a really, really small and compact light. So you can see here, this is a AA battery, just to give you a bit of a size comparison. And it's also extremely lightweight, uh, weighing in at 71 grams. Um, so particularly suitable for any adventure where light you know, and weight are, are at a premium. Um, but obviously any outdoor adventure, I mean, it's, it's very, very, very versatile and I can't really think of much an excuse for not including it in, in my pack, uh, you know, to be honest. Now, the lumen output, it has a boost function, uh, which I'll show you in a moment. Uh, it's like 300 lumen, you know, so it actually is uh, super bright. So that's it just up on the boost there, just activated by a double, a double tap, you know, on, on the top. Uh, this is your kind of on button here, so fired up on because um, through the, your different power levels and then any time a double tap will put it there into boost. So the, the boost is 300 lumen. It has a high power mode then of 150 lumen uh, and then a low power, or sorry, a mid mode of 50 and a low power of, of five. Um, I think I've got those right. Uh, and obviously as well, really, really good run times. You know, the, the high power I think is two, to 2.2 2 hours, something like that. And on the lowest setting, it'll run at your five lumen, it'll run for something like 80 hours. So weight, uh, I think with any light, you know, it's important how much light does it put out and how long does it run time, or how long is the run time, and, you know, and how heavy is it? So I mean, all of those features, you know, are really, really, really good. Looking at some of the other features of the light, and um, it is, uh, it has an IP rating of 66. You know, uh, the, the dust ingress protection is pretty much, um, you know, full. Uh, and then it will, will withstand sort of kind of water jets, you know, or high water pressure from any direction. Not actually submersible, but kind of one step up that from that, or sorry, one step down from that. So you don't really need to worry at all um, if the light uh, is exposed, you know, to a lot of, a lot of moistures. All right, so looking at some of the other um, fantastic features that I think this light has. It has dual power mode, uh, which means that you can use it with uh, the rechargeable battery that comes as standard. Uh, um, I actually have a, a AA battery in here just at the moment. Um, and then that's just your rechargeable. Uh, the connection here and here, uh, it's just simply like a half, a half turn. Um, and, and that's it. Uh, and then your tap will then just fire, fire it up. Uh, just running through the different modes. So dual power, you know, from your rechargeable battery or in fact, you know, a, a double A, which is a, a super feature. Uh, the charging itself is with a magnetic charger. And I sort of think that, I think we should, it's, it's nice to actually see companies moving on from a standard, you know, USB or USB-C or whatever it happens to be. So the actual little plates are here and then this just pick, pops, pops on um, and then, into your, uh, I'm just using a power bank really just at, at the moment. And hopefully you can see that there, as soon as I've switched the power bank on, the um, charging status indicator light will come on and that then will stay from red and then just change on to green. I'll maybe show you that, you know, happening in a moment. So that's then sort of how you actually charge it. I mean, this is actually quite, obviously if I give it a big shake, it's gonna fall off, but it's a good solid connection there. And I think it's great to see that sort of, you know, see companies moving forward and getting away with the, uh, the USB. Uh, I think it also helps the ingress protection uh, because, you know, there's nothing here that, that actually is, is open. Um, so a great, you know, feature of, of the light. Um, Adaptability wise, then you have a little metal sort of like carabiner hook, you know, here. And that just hooks on, you know, you can hook that on to, a, you can actually hook it on to a rucksack or you know it can just pop onto your charger belt uh, or even I've seen 
I've seen it, you know, being hooked on the key rings, you know, pretty much, you know, a- anything at all. And obviously, of course, for hanging itself uh, in your, excuse me, in, in your tent. Now, apart from the uh, magnetic charging technology, another technology that's in the light is, uh, I think, lead, lead lens are called micro prism technology. Um, uh, and the way that sort of works is that it, it sort of produces really warm, glare free illumination. So the, the light itself, it's hard to describe, it kind of punches out a really good spread of light, but it's not, there's not, it's not really harsh, you know, so that micro prism technology, you know, really helps with, with that. All right, so next up uh, is the uh, ML6 Warm Connect. Uh, this is uh, a little bit heavier, so it's like, two, I think it's 260, 270 grams. Um, uh, so it's a lot more powerful. It has a boost mode, I think, of 750. Um, it has a, a power mode of like 500. Then the next one drops down to 100, and then it drops down to 5. And obviously, really, really good run times. I think on the um, mid mode, it'll run something like 12, 12 hours, you know, which is which is fantastic. And I think like 80 hours, you know, on on the low output, which is the 5 lumen. Um, it feels certainly to me, you know, very. Um, very very well made you know it's it's, it's compact it, it's really really well you know screwed together um, and it's, it, it's brimmed you know are, are absolutely full of features you know so the top you know here for example uh, you've got like USB uh, in here so that can be used um, to to power phone and you can still actually charge your phone while the light is lit uh, which is a great feature then to do the opposite and that is, you know, and that really fits in. It's a good tight, you know, steel there. Now, the, the, the light is actually rated, again, it's IP66, so ingress protection 66, the same, you know, as, as the ML4, so really, really good protection against dust and moisture. So then the opposite from that then is actually, is, is powering it. Uh, so again, you have your, your magnetic, um, your magnetic charging here, it pops on and, uh, this is actually incidentally is also a lead lens, it's a wee small power bank, it's a Flex 3. And one of the benefits of this is the battery, the rechargeable battery inside this, then also is the same battery as for the actual light. Um, so that will just pop in there and we will be charging away. Again, there's a charging status indicator light, you know, on the top of the light. You'll not be able to see that at the moment, but I will show that to you, you know, uh, you know shortly. So that's really a really good feature there, uh, your magnetic charging, um, which I think, like I said on the other light, is much better than sort of, you know, just a, a USB. All right, so one of the amazing features of, of this light uh, is the fact that it's all controlled through an app and you can set your light up to do whatever, whatever you want, pretty much. Uh, and at night, just whenever it's a bit darker, obviously, so I'm just hitting the connect now. You'll see the light as soon as it connects. That's us ready to go. Um, and then just under the different controls, that's just it on full power, on mid power, and low power. So back to, to mid and back on full. What's happening here is you can also dim. Um, it's changing it into red light mode, so the light's going to really drop here. Um, different options. Okay. And then back onto the white light mode, and then just showing you a pulse setup. So it's pulsing up and down position. <coughs> so it's just every now and again it's just giving a couple of flashes to show you the position of the light um, and blink is then a more a more constant so just summarizing here uh, regarding the ML6 warm connect on uh, my right and your left um, there's a lot of features on this light I mean there really really is um, and the power bank function the um, controllability you know with your mobile phone uh, the sort of like little lit wrist or remote control you know as well you know with it so the lights very very well featured the micro prism technology uh, which hopefully you'll be able to see you know at the moment it's not putting out a harsh you know white light it's more a warm anti-glaring type light and a few other features as well now i said earlier on the price point of this uh, hopefully my face isn't too lit up here but the price point of this light is a hundred pounds um, so would I spend £100 on this light? Yeah, I mean, absolutely. I mean, there's just so many features. Uh, I've really been 
pressed with the clarity of the light output, you know, how much light it actually gives out. Um, I've been impressed, you know, with the build quality, you know, as well. Uh, and it certainly does feel like, you know, a hundred pound light. So, you know, well done, you know, in that respect. So now um, summarising and looking at the uh, ML4, uh, you know, warm here on my left and your right. Um, this is a great little light. Uh, I have to say, you know, I've been very, very impressed with it. Uh, the bottom line is, you know, would, do I think it's worth the money and would I take it on overnight camping trips where weight, you know, is, is, is critical? Uh, the answer to both uh, the camping trips, yeah, definitely, I will definitely be packing this in my bag. Uh, there's really no excuse not to. The light output is great. The run times are really, really good. Um, and it, it's a nice warm, you know, sort of sort of light and it just takes up absolutely no space. And the weight, as I said, at 70 odd grams is, is fantastic. Uh, price of this is 39.99. And again, I, I personally do honestly think it represents really, really good value for money. So um, thank you very much, you know, for tuning in to the channel. I hope you've enjoyed uh, the sort of shots and different aspects that I have of, of these two lights. Um, I do a lot of sort of videos and I'll be posting more videos so don't forget you know to, to look out for those and give us a like and a subscribe you know would be great you know too so the channel again is is um, Tom Haney Adventure uh, thank you very much for tuning in and watching and listening mm -hmm.